Greetings and salutations, booktube. I am Ariel, and welcome to my March TBR. Um, so the reason why I haven't really done any videos for the past month or so is because there has been a lot of things going on, and I've barely read anything, and I just couldn't keep up with doing videos because uh, we've had some stuff happen that just kept me from trying to do these videos, and so. I have been trying to clean my room and I created this reading corner so I'll do, be doing more of my videos here because that is pretty much it. I, For March I put some St. Patrick's Day decorations up because, and I'm fixing my hair again because my hair never stays in one place. And if you hear some weird noise in the background, it's either my grandfather doing stuff or my cat just beating her. For the month of March, one of the things I really like to read is, going along with the St. Patrick's thing, is The Last Days of Magic by Mark Tompkins, and it is a book about basically the last days of magic in Ireland and everything like that, and I really wanted to read it this month. Next is Voyager by Diana Gabaldon. I've actually started this, and you see how thick this is? I want to finish this at least at least most of it before the next season premiere which is in April so I will be reading this uh, Gathering of Shadows by E.V.E. E. Schwab I've also started this I, I've been slow at reading and that is because I've been trying to get stuff done I've been trying to clean my room and my cat is driving me nuts right now I mean Seriously. Uh, I read the. I have the first book. I really want to get this book, but I wanted. I read some reviews, and they said the second one wasn't really good. Uh, and I would like to get a Conjuring of Lights to read that as well. So I will be reading that. I wanted to read this Stocking Drop the Ripper by Carrie Mascalico. I'm sorry if I'm mispronouncing your name. Um, uh, I thought this was interesting because I heard that the sequel to this is called Hunting Dracula, which I have plenty of books on my ancestor. Yes, I'm related to Dracula, and I really love it. And so I thought this would be interesting because I don't read this. And I really like Jack the Ripper, too. I even watched the new show time after time just because it has H.G. Wells and Jack the Ripper in it. And so, you know, that's just one of my things. And last but not least is My Lady Jane. I've actually started reading this. I'm like 100 pages in. I need to continue to read this so I can at least finish it. And so, I really love it. It reminds me of Ella Enchanted. And Ella Enchanted was just as wacky as this is. It's been a long time since I read Ella Enchanted. Um, but this is based on the story of Lady Jane Grey, who, if you did not know, was queen for nine months, and my cat really wants to be on my lap right now. Say hi, Dust. Yeah, she's been like that for the past few days, so she's gonna really start bugging me. She was, she was almost made queen, and she was right, made queen around the time of, right before Edward and or right before Mary and right after Edward died, uh, Henry VIII's children. And so it actually does mention Edward, Mary, and Elizabeth, which, and, and it also puts it in a style that is more like a teenage writing than an actual historical novel because the way it's written is not what you would actually say during the time that they were there. Seriously. So that is it for my... March TBR. I will hopefully be doing more videos this month. I really want to do a St. Patrick's Day tag, which, you know, since I have these decorations up, I will hopefully be doing that. And so I will see you in the next video. Bye!